Hello everyone, welcome to another video from Somos Biology. In this video, we are going to talk about the difference between co-dominance and incomplete dominance. Yes, many people confuse between incomplete dominance and co-dominance. So what are these things? Let's hop in. In this picture, you can clearly see there's a difference shown in color where the parents are flowers. One is red flower, another one is white flower. If we cross them, we can get either pink flower or we are getting a flower with white and red all together. What does that mean? These are two separate situations. Now, when we get a pink flower, it we call, we're calling it incomplete dominance. When we get a white and red spotted flower, we call it a co-dominance. Now, why is this so? Let's understand the definition between co-dominance and incomplete dominance. The definition says based on appearance in offspring. In co-dominance, appearance of both parental phenotypes are visible as you can see in this picture of co-dominance we are seeing white color as well as red color prominently in a single flower so yes both the parents color is visible in co-dominance in incomplete dominance appearance of completely different color is visible in this case of incomplete dominance the flower color is pink so that's a mixture of red and white we're not seeing red or white we are seeing a pink third different phenotype effects of alleles what are the effect of different alleles both parental alleles show their effect independently in co-dominance while in incomplete dominance none of the parental effect is produced uh, right none of these individual alleles show itself uh, instead they are showing something of a blend that is a pink which is a blend of red and white then there are examples. What are the examples of codominance? The Rowan character of cows and the inheritance of AB blood group. These are both examples of codominance. While incomplete dominance, the inheritance of height, weight, eye color and skin color are examples of incomplete dominance. And in many cases, the incomplete dominance are regulated by multiple alleles like our blood group, ABO blood type regulated by multiple alleles where it's regulated by capital A, capital B allele. Presence of capital AB together gives us AB blood type. Absence of A and B both gives us O blood type. Presence of A only gives A blood type. Presence of B only gives us B blood type. So these are the examples of incomplete dominance so i believe it has a clear understanding if you understand this please hit the like button share this video with your friends and subscribe to this channel to get more videos like that in future